on it here. We're going to do a few stretches, focusing largely on the lower body and a little bit on the upper body. Here we go. All right, first we're gonna do a calf stretch. So I'm gonna utilize this stool here. If you have a stair that you can drop your heel off of, uh, anywhere that you can uh, get a nice stretch for the back of the calf. So they're gonna come to the edge, kind of put the ball of the foot on the edge of the stair. And then from here, you're gonna lower the heel down, feel the stretch in the back of the calf, lower part of the leg. As you feel it start to relax, the side that you're stretching, you can bend the knee in just slightly and then extend the knee back out. Bring that heel continue to drop down. Make sure you're not arching the back here. So we'll do that a few more times. Bend the knee in, extend the knee, lowering the heel down. A couple more, in, and back. Slightly bring the knee in and lowering that heel down. When you're ready, same thing, other side. Coming to the ball of the foot, dropping the heel off the edge, Give it a moment there, start to feel it loosen up and lengthen. Once you feel like you're starting to get some length in the back of that calf, again, we'll slightly bend the knee forward and extend the knee. Bend the knee in, extend, twice more, in, out, in, and out. If you feel particularly tight in your calves, please give another touch to that. Otherwise, we're gonna to move to the quads next. So standing nice and tall, you can practice some balance here if you'd like or steady yourself, lifting everything up, looking to grab onto one foot, pulling that heel towards the glute, keeping the hips nice and square. Soft bend in the support leg, abdomen drawn in so we're not arching the spine. Now, whenever you're stretching, you just wanna to try to breathe, focusing on your breath. As you're breathing, look to breathe in through the nose, out through the mouth. One more breath here. And release. Great job. Release that foot. In between sides, we're going to open up the inner thighs. So set the feet nice and wide. Soft bend those knees. We're going to reach the arms out. Draw the shoulders back. And then we're going to take it into a side lunge here, also known as our Cossack stretch. Both feet are firmly planted. We're gonna get a nice stretch on the inner part of the thigh. And sometimes you'll also feel it on the lower and outer part of the leg here. We're gonna go twice on each side. Foot is planted and knee drives out. We don't want this knee dropping in. Breathe in as you come back to the center. Nice tall chest, gently exhale, sinking into that side lunge. Breathing, coming back up and exhale. Very good. Shimmy those feet back in and then quad stretch on the opposite side. Draw everything up and in, squeeze the shoulders back. You can practice balance if you'd like. Soft bend the knee, abdomen nice and strong. In through the nose, out through the mouth. We're gonna take nice deep breaths. The hips level here, especially if you're balancing. and release great job next we're going to go into a toe touch or a jefferson curl soft bend the knees draw the abdomen in chin to the chest and nice and slow here sliding the hands down the thighs down the shins seeing where your body wants to reach today allow the head to be heavy draw the chin in and then when you get to that bottom position keeping strong in the midsection look to breathe into the back of the torso in through the nose Expanding the back of the rib cage, out through the mouth. One or two more breaths here. On that next inhale, gradually start to stand back up. Standing nice and tall. Very good. From here, we're gonna take a seat in the chair and open up through the hips. So our seated figure four, sitting right on the edge of the chair, draw one foot up and gently invite this knee to drop down. You can hold the hand on the same side knee, shoulders back and sitting nice and tall. I invite you to close the eyes here and just breathe smooth in through the nose and out through the mouth.
two more breaths and then we'll switch. Good, when you're ready, pull that leg up, set it down and same thing other side, foot up, grabbing onto the ankle, inviting that knee to lower down. You can set the hand on the knee. You go with these to be subtle stretches, nothing intense. And then back to the breathing, in through the nose, out through the mouth. Whether you're doing these after spending some time with the computer or after a challenging workout, the breathing will just help calm your nervous system, help your body to heal and recover. Very good. Go ahead and come on out of that stretch. And that's our session for today. So just a short stretch, help loosen up the body, open up some of the joints.